How to create a hiring plan. Before we get started, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Looking to hire graduates? Head over to our website to find top graduates at giveagradago.com. In this video we will cover What is the purpose of a recruitment plan? Why is hiring the right person so important? Questions to answer in your hiring plan Your recruitment strategy plan And things to consider in your hiring plan First, it's important to establish What is the purpose of a recruitment plan? The purpose of a recruitment plan is to ensure that you are attracting and hiring the right candidates from the start. Why is hiring the right person so important? One of the most important parts of growing a business is employing the right person for each job. Hiring the right people can contribute to the overall growth of your company and can also lessen the need for you to hire more employees. Graduates can be a great addition when hiring for your company. Grads are enthusiastic, adaptable and can bring fresh ideas to the table. Next, think about these questions to answer in your hiring plan. Number 1. What are your targets? Think about this in terms of revenue and wider business goals. Number 2. What is your budget? Including both internal and external hiring costs. Number 3. How are you going to make sure your new hires stay? Will you focus your hiring plan on employee retention? Number 4. What is your job specification? Have you listed what you're looking for? A good idea is to break down your recruitment strategy into steps. Number 1. Think about if you need multiple hires, one-off hires, or graduate placements. Number 2. Create a timeline. Decide on your time frame and work out how long the hiring process takes. What do you want your new hires to achieve and in what time frame? When do you want new starters to join? What impact will the time they join have on the business? What date is going to work best in terms of training, demand, and busier times of the year? Number 3. Budget. Allocate budget effectively. This will help your company to achieve its hiring goals. Costs to factor in. Internal costs include training, salary, and onboarding. External costs include job boards, advertising, and recruitment agencies. Number 4. Turnover. How are you going to make sure your new hires stay at your company? The process doesn't end when the offer is accepted. Onboarding should be a key component of your hiring plans. Preparing onboarding in advance will reduce dropouts and ensure that employees are fully engaged. Number 5. Define the graduate role. In your job description, detail a list of duties and responsibilities. It's important to highlight specific skills or experience required. Number 6. Determine your salary bracket. Look at the market in order to work out the salary bracket you should be offering. Research which other perks will help you stand out from your competitors. Number 7. Establish your company culture. Ensure the candidate will fit into the team. Have several members of the team speak to them and ask about their interests and hobbies. Number 8. Look beyond their CV in the hiring process. In your interview with a candidate, focus on learning about intangible skills and qualities that may not be visible on their CV. You may find from speaking to a candidate that they show a real sense of drive and ambition that you weren't aware of. And lastly, number 9. Set candidates a test or task. If you're unsure about whether a candidate fits the bill, a short test or task can be a good way to decide. Perhaps a problem-solving simulation, role-play, or a written test. To conclude, we have covered. What is the purpose of a recruitment plan? Why is hiring the right person so important? 
questions to answer in your hiring plan, your recruitment strategy plan, and things to consider in your hiring plan. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video please subscribe to our YouTube channel and click like and share. For recruitment services and more advice visit giveagradago.com.